Rios Multisite enables multiple Rios systems to be connected across a network for wide area radio communications. With the configuration shown here, three systems are connected with Rios Multisite. My local system is shown here with the home icon. Connected systems are shown in the multi-site column. The user is able to select these sites to view the connected assets at that location. The user is able to use features such as the talk group, listen, and other functions of Rios to connect wide area sites to the local assets. For example, the user can use the listen function to monitor a remote radio, as shown here. Notice the color coding to indicate a remote site. Additionally, the user can create wide area patches by selecting the local asset they wish to connect, in this case, an APX portable radio, the remote radio they wish to connect, and confirming the patch. With this configuration, multiple radios are connected within a wide area patch and shown with the color bands to indicate their location. The user is able to add to these sites the same fashion they would with a local site. For remote wide area connectivity. To remove the patch, use the break function, select the center node, and confirm the patch. Return home to view local assets. To add an additional site with Rios Multisite, use the global configuration tool found under configuration. Select configuration and select the global config tool to add a new site. To access, you will first need to log on to your site. Select the site, in this case, TAC10136, and select Connect Primary. Input your password, which in this case is admin. You will see the sites that you have available that correspond to your site list. To add the new site, select Add New Site. Input the site name for how, wish, how you wish it to appear. In this case, I will call it 10155 TAC Kit. The site ID, which is the US ID, in this case, is 10155. The IP address, which is the public facing IP address of the system, in this case is 166.143.8.71. The IP override may be used for local connections for clients that are connecting locally through a network. In this case, I'll leave it blank. If necessary, select a color to differentiate the server. Select OK. Update all, and the server will reach out to find the available Rio server. The system is now configured with the site. To configure the client to view the site, select Configuration, Site Config, Show Global Sites, and here we see the 10.155 system. Select the site to show within the client. Select OK. We now see the assets that are associated with this particular configuration. We can now create a patch with these on multi-site if we have permissions to the site. When you select talk group and the assets are grayed out, you currently do not have permissions to the site. You will need to grant permissions using configuration selecting the asset, unlocking the asset, and now when I pick talk group, I'll have access to this particular site. These configurations can be set up by the system administrator. In this case, we've created a site-to-site -site patch with a new site between two XTL mobile radios.